<laughs> so I'm very happy that you're here <laughs> and you're there. So for me, it's very interesting to watch my audience and how you perceive these illusions. For this, uh, I have brought with me is an almost perfect illusion. Almost perfect. And all I need is, uh, is a newspaper. And it don't have to be an actual one. Or don't have to be stand something inside. Um, it's not what's about the newspaper. It's just what I'm going to do with that and how you perceive it. Okay? So let's watch you here. Sorry, I cannot watch you at home, but uh, I will see. Okay. Ah, interesting. Okay, not sure, but uh, maybe you raise your hand if you had the impression that I have torn the newspaper. Yeah, it works. <laughs> it's an illusion. I haven't. Yeah, and, and I explain why it's so perfect. Because I combine two illusions at the same time. The first is called the acoustical illusion. The sound that you heard, I simulate with my mouth. <laughs> and the second, um, beside the sound illusion, is the so-called the optical illusion. The optical illusion makes the impression that these are separate pieces. The only problem on the almost perfect illusion is you get no applause. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because everybody thinks uh, to tear up the newspaper, everybody can do that. But, merely, uh, but, but maybe I can get a huge applause if I erase the illusion, if I, if I quit it. No? I cancel the illusion. So you see what's real. It's only... <laughs> Almost perfect, huh? <laughs> okay. So, um, but there are also magicians uh, in the world. They are not that honest. They're like me. Yeah, not that fair. Because they like to use their magic to get your money. You know the three shell game? Do you know how you can protect yourself against uh, losing money? No? Don't, don't play. Don't play? <laughs> and you feel safe? Uh oh. You're in danger. But you're lucky too. Because uh, I brought with me uh, the new version of the new three shell game. Uh, they changed the game. I, show, I, I have brought it with me here. Looks elegant, isn't it? <laughs> it isn't. It's the same cheating as before. You will lose all your money. But so you will play the game is because it looks so easy now. No? Because they have reduced the numbers of cups to only one. Now if I ask you, what do you think under which cup? <laughs> <laughs> you think you can make that, huh? <laughs> Uh, that's a dangerous, yeah? But the second thing, they don't use uh, a ball anymore. Yeah, they use a die. And now you think it's a totally new game. But it isn't. It's the same cheating as before. But one thing is new in this game. Have you noticed what? It's not the bell. <laughs> the bag? The bag, right. Please check the bag. Please examine it. Anything suspicious on the bag? What's your name? Jacob. Jacob. Yeah. Jacob. Anything uh, suspicious? No. Nope. Okay. Good. Do you know why you couldn't found anything? Because there isn't anything. Because this is only for transportation. It had nothing to do with the whole swindle. <laughs> <laughs> okay. But the, the game is easy. You have to guess where the die is. I do this for Jacob in slow motion. Uh, when I'm too fast, tell me. Yeah? <laughs> Where is? Under the, Under the cup? Are you sure? How sure? In percent? About 85. 85%. <laughs> so Jacob can bet now $85. <laughs> <laughs> no? 
<laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, put it on the table. <laughs> Imagine I put it on. Yeah, yeah. Imagine you would have won. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But this this game you can only win in imagination. Yeah, because this is cheating. If you put the money for real, it's gone. Because there are three possibilities where the die can be. Under the cup is only the first. The second one is my hand. The third one is in the pocket. Understand? Under the cup? In the hand? Or in the pocket? So, what would you think in this situation, where is the die now? In the cup. In the cup. It's a good guess. It's wrong, but it's good. <laughs> <laughs> Little hint? <laughs> In the pocket, yeah, you can guess three times in this game, but, <laughs> <laughs> but this time you would lose two because the cheater reached into the pocket, searched for a die, and says, oh, I'm so sorry, there is no die. <laughs> then he makes a suspicious move, and you realize you lose. <laughs> it's a cheating game, I told you, huh? But my advice is, if you see this on the street, <coughs> never touch the die or the cup, even if you're so close like here. Because these are violent criminals. A uh, uh, finger is easily broken, huh? Oh. Yes, I do this for your entertainment. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not one of them. I'm fair, I'm honest. You can check everything exactly. Good? Yes. Yeah, you haven't shaked it. I shake it for you, because if you shake it, you see, the bottom gets loose. Can you see? No. No? Hold your hand, like so. Can we grab the hand? Here? Okay. Then I can put it through. Wow. Very nice. Have you felt it? <laughs> I go there. Please hold your hand. Do you feel it? Yes. <laughs> I do it for everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Vice versa. So, so. You only have to drop it into the uh, uh, cup, and then you only need two fingers uh, from the left hand, so to, to take it out of the slit here from the bottom. Huh? <laughs> okay, I explain, I explain. Um, it's all done by using psychology. May I influence you by using psychology? Sure. Yeah, I do this, uh, I could ask you before, that's more fair, huh? because I'm fair. <laughs> So, what's your name? Jerry. Jerry? Jerry, Jerry. Can you see the die? Yes. Oh, by the way, I will influence Jerry in a way so Jerry will guess right. <laughs> yeah? You will actually know where the die is. Do you know why? No. It's more fun. <laughs> <laughs> so, can you see it? Yes. Please notice the little psychology hints in a moment, yeah? You hear it? Yes. Okay. Um, Jerry, what do you think where the die can be now? Uh, in the cup. In the cup? In the cup. That's how psychology works. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't it great? They are... okay. It's always under the cup. Ah. <laughs> I confused myself because of the lying, so I have to, to apologize to Jacob. I'm, I'm so sorry. I lied to you. Do you know when? No? $75? No. <laughs> a little bit earlier when I told you that the bag has nothing to do with the swindle. <laughs> ah. <laughs> <laughs> so I hope you learned independently how many bags are used, or dice are used, or cups are used. This is a cheating game. You will lose your money. Even me as a specialist, I don't know everything. For instance, the, the, the thing with the lemon. Yeah, the, the lemon. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> the secret, a little secret in the box. But normally, ma magicians are not allowed to tell secrets. But I make an exception at the De end. Most at the end, a végén. I, I will reveal the secret to you, okay? But before, I'm, I want to protect it with a glass so nobody can get De near it. De most ezt meg, megvédem a pohára. Okay. 
Copacho. Good. Now, may I ask somebody who understands my English? We are all friends here, you see, there's no problem. Anybody who understands, who, who hasn't been here, who understands English? Segitu. Santiago, you haven't been here. <laughs> Come on, we have a nice round of applause for this young man here. <laughs> Just, no, no, you sit here. Okay. Who, uh, telling me yesterday, comes from, from all the way from Chile, but he's living here. Yes. So, but you, you're hung, you can translate hung, in Hungarian for me? No. No. <laughs> in, spa in Spanish, we, we can speak in Spanish a little bit. Okay, well, you have a, a, a favorite card, Santiago? Well, I have a card. No, I don't know. Now, I have a, a okay, special card. Like, can Kedvencem. we see this here? I have a special card in the pack. Van egy speciális kártyám a csomagban. Which is the the Joker. A Joker. Yeah, the Joker. And you know that the Joker is the only card in the whole deck that Tudjuk can take the identity of any other card. Tudjuk, hogy a Joker az a lap, amely yes? bármelyik yes. uh, kártyát. So, so, Diego, uh, name a card. Helyet. What what card? Can you have that five, five diamonds. Whatever you want. Káro no. five, five of diamonds? Yes. Okay, it's a good card. So write five of that. Írd ide. Oh, oh, well, I, I write there. Én írom ide. Five of... I'm not so good, I thought maybe you. <laughs> It's good, five of diamonds. And I make my initials, Roberto Jobbi. Aláírom. You make your initials, which are different than mine, of course, yeah. yes. Uh, here? Yes, what, what are you on? Jeez, that's very nice. Yes. That's you? Yes. Good. <laughs> Now look, but yes, we close that because of now. Can you see that? Good. Now look. I hope everybody can see that. I'm going. Now let me put this maybe a little bit over here. Can can everybody? Now look, Santiago, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to make the card vanish. There will be a volcano, uh, like Island volcano. Like Iceland volcano. Mint az Islandi volcano. Maybe a little bit more. You, it's okay. You can okay. stay. I'm joking, it's okay. okay. Look, I cast the shadow of my hand over. It has happened. Mac 13. Did you see it? Last pack. You, you didn't see it. Santiago, turn over the Joker. For this mag. Show them. Show them. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Now. That is the part which is not bad. Ez az a része, amelyik nem rossz. But the part which is really good is going rész, to come. Amelyik nagyon jó, ez csak most fog következni. Because everybody of great intelligence who watches this always has a question. Mindenki, aki értelmes, van egy kérdés ehhez. Thank you for asking. <laughs> Hol van a Joker? <laughs> Where is the Joker? Hol van a Joker? Exactly. Good. Well, that's my secret. Ez az én titkom. Ah, I told you where the secret is. And I also told you De megmondom, hogy I hol a would titkom. reveal the secret to you. Yes? És azt is mondtam, hogy megfogom, felfogom fedni. I don't want to touch that. Nem uh, szeretném megfogni. Take away the, so take away the, the, the card kártyát. first. First the card. Először a kártyát. I, I hope this doesn't jam. Maybe it jam. I don't know. Can, can you Remélem. shake a little bit? Or? You lift up, maybe it, it's stuck. Oh, okay. But never mind. Well, okay. Can you come with the camera? The the, the lid stuck in the glass. It doesn't matter. But you, you can, yes, go ahead. Lift it up. Yes. Okay. Is it something? Can, can we show that? that what, what, <laughs> what is it? Yes. Yes. Uh, would you, look, you you go to 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 open it up yourself. Yes. Sanne, kom even dicht bij me staan. Sanne, is het je trouw, vriendschaps- of verlovingsring? Het is, het is trouwring. Trouw onderdeel ring. van, ja. Dit is je kans. Oké. Okay. De ring. Ik zou vanaf te komen. Ja, dat moet ik ja. Dat niet zeggen. Ik zou hem in een doosje kunnen doen. Doosje dicht, Sim Salabim, en weg is jouw ring. Maar dat zou je niet leuk vinden, toch? Nee, dat vind ik niet leuk. Dus doe ik het anders. Doosje gaat dicht, ik zet hem even op tafel. De ring gaat verdwijnen. En als het goed is, met de klemtoon op... Als het goed is, zal de ring dadelijk in het doosje verschijnen. Als het mij lukt om hem in het doosje te krijgen, zonder het doosje nu nog aan te raken, 
is het de eerste keer. Het is nog nooit gelukt. Ja. Thuis te wachten op telefoon. De ring onder de zakdoek. Van hier, zo naar da uh, daar, in het doosje. Ik maak het mezelf nog iets moeilijker. De dame die daar staat, kom even deze kant op. En zou je voor mij de ring met de linkerhand met twee vingers vast willen houden? En kom even rechts naast me staan. Hoe is de naam? Machtel. Machtel. Ik heb hier een heel klein magisch belletje. Zou jij met een belletje drie maal, oh, maak intussen even een draaiende beweging, zou je drie maal boven het doosje willen bellen? Dan verdwijnt hij hier en hij verschijnt daar. Ja, ga je gang. Eén, twee, drie. Is die weg? Nee. Oeh, dan help ik mee. Eén, twee en drie. Spontaan verdwenen. Nou hoop ik dat het gelukt is. Maak het doosje even open. Op mijn huwelijk dan maar. Ja, oh. oh, kijk, dit is leuk. Het is een piercing geworden. <laughs> Waar wil je hem hebben? Ja, ja. Niet, 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 niet. Ik maak wel een grapje. Het is geen piercing. Dit is de klepel van de bel. Wil je nog één keer bellen? Ah, nee. En kijk eens in de bel. Nee. nee. Helemaal vast aan de haak, daar hangt hij, de ring. En ik haal hem er natuurlijk even uit. En ik geef je meteen een gouden tip mee. Geef hem nooit meer aan een goochelaar. Want hij is weg voordat je het weet. Oude goed. Did you like your Lena Bobbitt thing? Yeah, I like that. Do you have any jokes? Do you tell jokes? No. You should have jokes. You have a hell of a sense of humor. You're very strange. <laughs> I can't use my lighter because it got dropped in the water and it's all wet. So I have to light these with a match. Chain smoker. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, is that got like a big flame on it or do I have to suck a lot? Last time I did this for Deke, he said, there's one that ain't lit, there's one that ain't lit, there's one that ain't lit. <laughs> Leave it to kids. <laughs> Doing a kid show is like walking through Lion Country Safari with a hamburger suit on. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that baby right there is real small. Is it getting hotter in here to you, Lee? Yeah. <laughs> I'm doing the smoke trick and he's over there going. Yeah. Yeah. What does your son do for a living, Mrs. Mollica? <laughs> he's a geek. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever been this close to an idiot? <laughs> I know you have. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering about doing this trick today, but what the hell?
Don't they look real? Yeah. See? Dan's coughing, John's coughing, everyone's coughing except me. This is why I want to get into pool. <laughs> Do you mind if I smoke? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> oh, man. You people have been dynamite. How long have we been here? Let's see, since about 11, 12, one. Has it been eight? <laughs> See, that, that destroys the magic of television. The people viewing this tape think that we were just sitting here for an hour and having fun. Are you kidding me? <laughs> How many times did you go to the bathroom yourself? Eight. You know, the funniest thing I ever saw in a bathroom was I was traveling with John and Pam Thompson one time. We went uh, to a trip, and Pam was in one bathroom, and I was at, well, that's obvious. <laughs> Remember, we heard the blow dryer going, and we just pictured her in there like this? No. And, uh, she's gonna kill me. Pam was in one room, and Johnny and I were in the other, and I was in the toilet. And there was something written on the toilet door, and it was the smallest print, even smaller than what you wrote on that first card. And I sat there, and I sat, and I had to j jack myself up, and I had to take my glasses off. And I got down, and you know what it said? You are now shitting at a 45-degree angle. <laughs> you, now, you'll remember that one, won't you? Now, the next time someone says, do you tell jokes, you say yes, and then you tell them that damn story. That's the... Do you, have you heard that one before? No. Because that really happened. Yeah, really? There's a lot of those normal things that say, uh, well, you know what they all say. <laughs> I don't know if they say the same thing in the ladies' room as they do in the men's room, but... They do? Uh, uh, uh. They do? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Stephen. For any of you younger children watching, <laughs> this will kill your teachers in school. <laughs> Boy, I must, I haven't looked at my face. It must be black all over. I keep pulling. Mm. <laughs> some of that dandruff crap. <laughs> <laughs> you are now shitting at the 45 <laughs> Grazie. Ho qualcosa da mostrarvi. 
Questa è una cartellina di plastica con un semplice, vedete, ecco, un foro in cui io metto un limone. Ecco, adesso il limone sta dentro ma è scomparso, è andato in un'altra dimensione che è molto difficile da intuire, ma se io voglio, ecco, riprendo il limone. <ride> Vedete? E se poi da questa parte lo metto e non dall'altra, ho una limonata. <ride> sì, grazie. <ride> Grazie, grazie. Allora, quando ero un ragazzo non avevo molti soldi per i giochi di prestigio e così cosa facevo? Usavo gli oggetti che trovavo in casa, mamma cuciva ed io usavo il suo ditale, per esempio. Lei ha un ditale? Sì? Ma ne ha uno con sé? Ah, ah no, ce l'ha a casa. Beh, eh, eh, eccolo, ecco, ce, ce ne ho io uno. Se poi per caso lei lo perdesse, ne ho un altro qui, eccolo. Ma se poi, se perdesse anche questo, ecco... Un altro, un altro, uno, ecco, nella manica, un altro di tale, no, cioè, ne ho quattro, visto? Quattro di tali, no, scusi, un attimo, ah, un altro, non riuscivo a prenderlo, ecco, ne posso trovare uno, due, tre, quattro, cinque, vedete? Tre, quattro, no, e il quinto? Credevo di averlo. Yeah, Eccolo, cinque di tali. <ride> Grazie. Questa è la parte più facile. La più difficile è farlo con tutte e dieci le dita. <ride> ecco qua. Questo è un ditale. È passato nell'altra mano. Ci provo di nuovo, eh? But don't look too close, you hurt your eyes. It's hard to focus, it goes across so fast. Oh, there it is. This is the difficult one, this one. Questa è la difficoltà it has vera. Via. È scomparso il ditale. Lo regalo a lei questo ditale come piccolo ritorno. Lo metta in tasca. Qualcuno per caso ha portato un mazzo di carte? Uh, ci, sono, ci sono delle carte da qualche parte? Ecco qua, ce le ho io, delle carte. Sono apparse da una mano invisibile. Ho dunque un mazzo di carte, tutte diverse tra loro. Vedete? Adesso io userò questo jack e poi magari il re. Sì, anche il re. È buono, è buono. Adesso guardate, io mostro le carte. Oh, è cambiato. Lo faccio ancora, eh? Lo faccio ancora. Guardate. È cambiato. Tre di cuori. <ride> Adesso divido il mazzo delle carte. Okay. Le mischio. Mischio queste carte. Le mischi lei, co come, come preferisce. Ok, le mischi come preferisce. Io devo stare attento, io guardo. Eh. Ok, bene, le mischi di nuovo. Molto bene, molto bene, un buon lavoro. Eh, C'è un motivo per il quale io vi ho mostrato queste carte. Queste carte sono vive, sono come degli animaletti addomesticati. Per esempio, eh, queste carte saltano, saltano, sta, fa, fanno capriole. Ecco, ecco, io adesso le unisco dal bordo inferiore, poi hop, la prima, la, la seconda, la, la terza, e poi, oh, la quarta, oh, nessun problema. Forse l'ultimo asso stava dormendo, ma eccolo, eccolo, eccolo qui. Bene, eh, per il prossimo gioco userò soltanto degli assi, eh, due rossi e due neri. Io voglio, voglio che i neri allo schiocco delle dita, ok? Provo ancora, i neri, i neri allo schiocco, ok? Ancora i rossi, i rossi, i rossi, i rossi di nuovo. Ok, controlliamo le carte, ok? Questo, le mischio, la metto sotto, schiocco, ok, butto giù, ok, guardate, schiocco, ok, nere, e queste le due rosse.
Bene, adesso potete vedere bene che io taglio il mazzo al centro perché non ho dimenticato le persone che stanno controllando le carte. Adesso io metto gli assi in mezzo e faccio, ok, schiocco le dita, ancora quattro volte ed ecco uno, due, tre, quattro, sono loro. Tutti e quattro. Ecco, adesso metto nel mazzo in modo da poterli riconoscere e vederli al centro. Ma adesso guardate, eh? guardate, guardate, non è difficile. Eh, qualcuno dice che il segreto è tenerle tutte unite, ma i miei sono separati l'uno dall'altro. Ecco, guardate, io... Ok. Uno, due, tre, quattro. Adesso l'ultimo è il più difficile, lo metto nel mazzo e con la punta rivolta verso il basso, ok, ok, io vi mostro la prima carta del mazzo, mentre è la seconda, la stessa cosa, schiocco, la terza, ok, schiocco, la quarta, ecco, proprio l'asso, semplice no? Adesso le metto nel centro, ecco, al centro questo è il momento più difficile ok questa carta è l'ultima è l'asso ecco qua eh, signora lei scelga una carta dal mazzo in maniera imparziale quella che vuole eccola perfetto faccia vedere, ecco la metta in mezzo, adesso io mescolo e tenterò di trovare la sua carta con una sola mano, il due di picche, no, 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 ma lo so benissimo che non è la sua signora, vediamo, vediamo, eccola, forse nove di denaro, no, 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 vediamo, sei di fuori, no, ma dov'è la sua carta signora? Come vede il dorso è uguale per tutte, è rosso, allora mi ha detto che non è il 6 di cuori, né il 2 di picca, né il 9 di denari. Ma qual è la sua carta, signora? Non è, non è nessuna di queste tre. Oh. Quale sarà la carta? Il 6 di fiori? Oh, il 6 di fiori, quello che dobbiamo cercare. Ma ne ho molti. Ecco, ecco, tutti i 6, tutti i 6 di fiori che puoi immaginare. Adesso, ora, io mescolo le carte. Ok. Giri una? <ride> Sarà questa? <ride> Eccola! <ride> Eccola! Ok, adesso come ultima cosa voglio mostrarvi questo... Ok, questo porta staglie e porta sigari, è un ricordo di una persona molto piccola. Ecco, io comunque prendo il sigaro, ecco, bene, a me piacciono i sigari, ma è di legno, può provare a rimetterlo dentro, signora? Ok, mm, no, 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 proviamo in un altro modo. Oh, beh, proviamo, no, non entra. Ma che è successo? Ma forse ce n'è un altro dentro. È di legno perfetto, non si può fumare. No, non si può fumare, lasciamolo qui. Ok. No, no, è legno perfetto, non, non, può, non può fumarlo, signore. Ok, io lo metto via. Ok, grazie, lei aveva un sigaro con sé, signore, grazie. Adesso, così... <ride> adesso lo metto nella mia mano schiocco ed è scomparso è scomparso ma forse so dove farlo riapparire eccolo qualche domanda? no? ok grazie molte grazie signora
Thank you.